Yen et toi. So a couple weeks ago, this place called Photo Lab Studio reached out to me and they invited me to drop by to try out their self-portrait studios and I thought that sounded really fun. So I asked if I could bring my boyfriend along to make it like a little pre-Valentine's Day date and they said yes. So that is currently what I'm getting dolled up for. These days, I've been like really looking forward to just like hanging out with friends and celebrating people's birthdays and looking forward to like going to events or doing like fun things socially. I feel like maybe it's a seasonal thing. I don't know because I already like hang out with my friends on a regular basis. I just realized like I have a bunch of birthdays coming up, but that also means that I'm going to be broke because I am actually a really big gift giver. I've actually recently realized that because my love language is acts of services. That's what I give and what I like to receive. Gift giving is like a subset of acts of services for me. It doesn't have to be very expensive, but if I see like someone that I love, like they need something, I'll keep that in mind and I'll like gift it to them, even if it's not for like an occasion if they really need it. I think I'm a pretty big gift giver in nature because I'm quite attentive. Well, that was a ramble. I think I'm really bad with like the makeup talk, <laughs> but I'm trying. Finishing touch. And this is the final makeup look. Yeah, you look good though. Your eyelashes look on. Yes, girl. Yes, girl. So I 
just took a shower feeling good feeling refreshed soup television shower the perfect trifecta it's been a very long work week and when i am just like entrenched in work working from home for days on end i typically like don't really wash my hair so i was on day two and a half virgin three day hair and it was about to cross the line of being like manageable to hella greasy anyways i am about to take my first french lesson in a very long time so a little background i did take french growing up took it all throughout middle school and for a couple of years in high school i didn't really take it that seriously over the summer as a lot of y'all know i took my dream solo trip to paris and that trip definitely inspired me to relearn this beautiful language also through that travel vlog people had the misconception that my french was actually good like it's really not it's barely conversational i definitely understand a lot more than i can speak but it's definitely not good so please do not think that um but i'm prepping myself and i want to be more fluent and more conversational for my next paris trip so today's french lesson is going to be through one of the top online language schools in the world lingoda on lingoda they teach four languages english german french and spanish as well as business english in small groups and private one-on-one -on -one classes the classes are 60 minutes scheduled through zoom and there are additional exercises and homework provided if you want to further hone your skills after class unlike other platforms that i've utilized in the past where they throw like random vocabulary at you or give you quizzes i really love that lingoda maximizes on conversation time and human interaction because those things are key to learning a language so i'm about to hop onto my class but if you're interested in learning a new language you can try lingoda for yourself with their seven day trial where you can take three small group classes completely for free just click the link below to find out more and receive a 30% discount on your first payment if you decide to continue. Bonjour. 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 Très bien. Très bien. Très bien. Comment ça va? Bonjour. Ça va bien. Uh, et toi? <laughs> Moi aussi, ça va très très bien. Merci beaucoup. Very good. Est-ce que je peux s'allier et dire au revoir? This is in one word. Oh, it's 